First game on. Let's do this. Dear Lord, my eyes. I forgot I have to re-blur this background because they changed a bit. But just from that cue, and I don't say this all too often. Actually, I don't say this ever. I feel like Ezio has some broken signatures, uh, especially this down sig and then the orb side sig. I feel like orb side sig is just going to be insane. Again, I never say this ever for signatures or for new characters but that guy that little hologram has a hitbox and it has a hitbox throughout the move throughout the duration of the attack you can use it to recover as well it kills pretty early relative to Ezio's strength he has five base which is completely average but his six definitely do pack a punch i want to try the orb sidelight into nsig i'm not sure if it works i don't want dodge window if they can jump again this is the first game on there we go. They did jump there. I don't know if that was perfect, if that was frame perfect or anything. Okay, that'll take some training room uh, knowledge. But at the very least, we can tell he's pretty strong. He's got some pretty strong sigs, which is kind of expected. They wouldn't release a character that has been in the works, cooking in development for maybe even as long as a year, because we all know how long this legal stuff takes. TMNT was like a year, right? So this is going to be probably a long time, maybe a little shorter since it's Ubisoft directly. But you see that. You see that. The perfect map, honestly, for this second game. I feel like this mix of blurring and unblurring backgrounds, it might be a bit jarring to the eyes, but it is kind of lore accurate to a degree. You know, Ezio, he's got, he goes in and out of being conscious because of Desmond or something. It, again, it's been a long time since I played those games. I should have downsigged, actually. I, was, I, I wasn't even thinking of what I was doing, but I guess I can do that. Yeah, he is, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. <laughs> no. I think I got a bit too excited there, but <laughs> that's nice. All right, and we're back to the unblurred. How many maps are there? And I, I just get Enigma two out of three games. Actually, I kind of like Enigma, so it's, it's kind of fine. But uh, I realized that I actually probably could have lived there. If I GC downsigged at the end, I'm pretty sure I would have lived. That just shows the inexperience with Ezio, I guess. I know the general conjecture with Ezio is all about, Hey, guitars! Why did you have guitars? Why did you have guitars? People are wondering what I think about it. I don't care. As long as he's fun, that is all that matters to me. I know there's thematic reasons why it makes sense. You use sword mostly in the games and the, the hidden blades are finishing moves. So it makes sense with the signatures. And you got the, the, the Apple of Eden. You have authority. I don't need any of that. I just want him to be fun. You could give him a rocket lance. And if I enjoyed it, I'd be like, hell yeah. That's my assassin right there. That's my king. I better not see it. I better not see any. That's your guitars. That's your guitars. I'm going to lose my mind. And we are going to laugh humorously, collectively, and recount about our Taco Bell aftermath. I don't know. Something I just figured out is the side sig charge animation is you got to be careful. It's you got to, I missed. Look at this. Look at this. It's the guy's pointing the wrong way, but then you appear the right way. Okay. I probably shouldn't have done it there. Oh my God. Do I live here? I actually lived. That's crazy. <laughs> I saved them. Never mind. I didn't. Did they save me? Thank you very much. Hey guys. I unlocked this orange hood for level two, so that's why I'm rocking this. But I gotta say, something about his design feels so fast, so fluid. Ezio, I don't know, maybe his sigs, his stats, all mixed together, he does feel just super quick, which I guess makes sense. He's the assassin, but I feel like they nailed the design. He actually doesn't have the most speed. He only has six base speed. Maybe if it was higher, he'd be able to prevent his family's murder. But overall, he's so much fun. Again, this is a character that has probably been in the works for upwards of, I don't know, nine months. A human life could be born in the amount of time that it probably took to bring this to fruition. So to see it in the light and to have it actually be insanely fun, also maybe a bit broken, it's it, it's pretty nice. Sword and Orb is a combo that I have been waiting for for a while, so you can probably hear it in my voice. I am a bit excited there. I definitely got caught in a bit of a trap. Don't downsig me. Uh, <laughs> no, I, I, I went too fast again. Check this out. Custom combo. <laughs> okay. You know, in my head, that was going to be the grounded version, not the aerial one. I would have been able to get a recovery off of it. I don't think I've even shown it off. Let's see if I can do it here. It moves so fast. All right, like this, you can true combo into recovery. Uh, but yeah, I, I guess that works too. I guess that works too. You can tell I'm having a good time and having fun because there's no music in the game. Uh, because I haven't even paid attention to the rest of his signature kit. I've just been using a couple. So I'm just so ingra ing ingrained, engaged. <sighs> Okay, I got real scared. Next level, I unlock the defense stance. That's probably what I'm going to be using for well, most of the time when I play Ezio. It's 5-6-5-6, five, six, five, six, which is a pretty good stat spread. Let's see. Down sig here. No, they waited for the recovery. They probably knew that one was coming. I was scared of an end sig there, to be honest. To be frank with you, but maybe I should be scared of more things. Ooh, I, I used my chase dodge, but... <laughs> okay. That move is crazy. 
Okay. I gotta get used to the hitbox of this down sig. You do retreat a little bit while using it, but you return right back to place. It's more like Jala down sig than it is any other retreating sig in the game or anything like that. So it, it's so good. That's a very strong signature. I do have to hit the side sig and the end sig on sword. I really, I haven't used those at all, uh, but you can see it right there. It's like a bit of a slash. And then it's, I think it's like a grab move. It has like a third hit. If it does hit, we'll find out together, I suppose. Recovery into this one, into down air. Uh, no, I saved again. Wait, they saved me. No, they didn't. Yes, they did. What is happening today? Why, why, why? I don't know. This is a good day. Oh, what a sig. You can use it so well to recover, I bet. Like, I'm good. I, I'm fine. I wasn't worried at all. I should probably catch this. Um, That almost worked, actually. Had I spaced it a bit better, had I known the hitbox a bit better, that actually would have worked. That is the crazy part. <laughs> okay. I gotta hit these moves still. I forgot again. Okay, there we go. There's the side zig and the end zig. Let's see, maybe I can bait them to recover high. There we go. That's a bit of a spike roo. Got two spikes on this character. That's a lot of active frames. All right, that's that's interesting. That's like a, it's like a two-parter almost. You have the upward slash, you got the downward slash. Good to know. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Look, I do that to myself all the time on purpose. And so if you do it to me, trust me, I'm happy about that. What was that hitbox? Oh, I tried to slide charge that again. I gotta get used to that, I gotta get used to that. It's not like Thor, you can't just slide charge. Ooh, that hit like the corner, I think, and then it had Mega Force. I can't explain to you why that killed there, but it did, for sure. Certainly, certainly did. Oh, they interrupted the jump. You saw the vision though. You saw the vision at the very least. That's all I can ask for. What a what a read there. Uh, I'm alive though. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know what's happening today, but I am living where I definitely should not. And that is, I guess, the trend, like right here. I think I'm still alive unless they, Unless they kill me. I think I'm still alive. Somehow? I think I'm still alive. <laughs> Somehow? Uh, this should not be happening. This should not be happening. But it is. Goodbye. I'm not employing any proper strategies. I'm not using his signatures. Probably as intended, but I am having a ball. I'm having fun. That is a... Uh, that goes off the wall. When, did you see that? You, you get the wall touch, right? I'm not great anymore. That's also a change in this patch. And then you go off the wall. Very interesting. I am making discoveries at the very least is what I'm doing. I am jumping into that and then dodging into that, unfortunately. But that is a... Uh, that's par for the course for me. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I backed up. I backed up out of the... <laughs> nice. We'll see if I can get something a little tricky here. I have an idea. Uh, <laughs> the idea didn't work. The idea didn't work at all. There's not enough time to grab that bomb and then combo it. Not even close. What was I thinking? I don't know. Let's do one last game here. Something I really want to try is using that sword down sig as an anti-ledge trapper tool. Let's say someone's got the sword. Actually, we're up against Ezio, so it's perfect. I can use it like right here. I don't want to give away my strat. I won't show it off, but you get the idea. Uh, someone's trying to get you with an end lighter with a down light off stage, and you can probably peek that over the ledge uh, and get something there. I don't know. I, I want to try it. I want to see if it works. I don't know if the hitbox will be good enough, but I presume it will be because the hitbox so far has definitely been good enough. They do a lot of wake up attacks, so we'll see if I can maybe sneak in that. I wasn't sure which sig that was going to be. I'm going to be honest. But look at that second side of that hitbox, that second part. That is a very strong signature looking like. Although, it's strong in niche areas, whereas some other ones are just strong in all areas. Which is like, strong in niche areas is something- Okay, that was a very weird position because of that platform. But I was saying that strong in all areas is something that, uh, not every signature and every character can say they have. And so, this is certainly- Oh, don't die, don't die. Okay, I'm gonna try and bait them so that I get edge goaded off stage. I wanna get more damage on them so it'll kill. Uh, it, actually, if I die here, it'd be even better that way. I don't get knocked so far out, but let's see. Do I- Oh, they could've- Probably done a side air there, but an end light here, that should be a good enough HP. We'll see. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and die here or at least get a weapon spawn. Actually, I wanna die before I get the weapon spawn, so hopefully they kill me here. Whee! I see an opportunity. Are they gonna downlight here? No, they're gonna sidelight off stage. Are they gonna downlight to ledge guard? It does work. It does work.